Hello, good afternoon. Uh, my name's Paul Bergen, and today I'm going to show you how to make a Castro Velvin co hangover cocktail, which I've invented. I've never invented a cocktail before, and I want to apologise because I sound like the <laughs> those annoying ads that you see before you get to see the YouTube video you really want to see. But I hope you want to see this. Now, why is it called a Castro Velvin hangover cocktail? So, why is this cocktail called a Castro Velvin hangover? Well, it's quite simple. Um, but basically, uh, it's in honour of uh, Escher's uh, illustration, Castro Velva, and all the weirdness of it, which I think would be enough to give anyone who doesn't touch a drink a hangover. Um, but also the Doctor Who story, Castro Velva, which was Peter Davison's first story as the Doctor. It was perhaps an allusion to um, Matthew Waterhouse, who was a regular cast member then as the companion Adric having a hangover um, when they one morning when they were filming a particular outdoors scene. But um, yes, it's mainly about the Escher print and the Doctor Who story per se, and the weirdness of Castro Velva. So what do we have? We've got dandelion and burdock. Now, I haven't got ca cocktail glasses, and I will be getting some because it was my birthday recently and they were ordered. So We'll just use this. And I haven't got a shaker, so I'm not going to shake the drinks, but we'll do it for. So if I put in a measure of dandelion and burdock, I would say in a cocktail glass about um just about a quarter and a third. When the shaker I'd say a third of dandelion and burdock and a third of the Prosecco because you just need a fairly um, cheap champagne. So we've got a Prosecco here, um, which, oh, no, that's not the Prosecco I want. If you just give me a moment because I don't want to create a mess. Yeah, here's one I opened earlier, just there, because I don't want bangs and fizz all over the laptop when recording this. And just a tiny drop more. And sort of, I can't mix it up, but sort of jiggle it around. And I won't drink it all has got the rest of the day ahead. That's a Castro Velvin hangover. It's basically uh, a third dandelion and burdock, which is, see how there, and a third Prosecco, which I can't quite do a third because of the glass, but that's the measure you should have in the shaker and pour in. You can also have a small amount of honey mixed in as well, and that adds to it. And whole idea is is that with the Castro Velvin hangover is it'll taste nice but it also tastes a little weird and that's the idea um because Escher's drawings were weird <laughs> and the area of Castro Velva the city that the doctor goes into and store Castro Velva is a little strange and uh the weirdness is meant to allude to the hangover not getting drunk but um chin chin and uh I hope you enjoy it. And